two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. There's the whistle. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Bernd Leno. I think his presence might make all the difference for this team. He's got lightning-fast reactions and uh, a coolness under pressure that allows him to make the big one-on-one -on -one saves. He's also very reliable under the high ball or when he's dealing with crosses, and I'd expect the whole defence to play with a bit more assurance with him in place. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. Saka finds himself eased off the ball. Kapu. And here's Alcacer. Alcacer! Goal! Villarreal! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. Arsenal trail at this early stage. How will they respond? Caballos. Unketia. He has a pop! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. And he's there to clear it. Turns and goes back. Receives, shoots! Same again, same outcome. Arsenal really are in the ascendancy here, and they know they have to register while that's the case. Forward it goes. Well positioned to make that interception. Arsenal have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. And it's played forward. Ball's out on the left now. And it's Kapu. Deftly done. And that has been cleared. And that's been won straight back. 15 minutes till half time. Hardly anything between the sides. And it's 1 0. A real chance to break. Unketia. He's through. Going for goal! And yes, it's there! Arsenal are level. His position was perfect. The invitation was there for him. And his response, absolutely clinical. Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set him free in the box.
And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, it's a very good contest with two very good sides and with such great individual talent on show, it could go either way. Gets into a dangerous position. Partey. Chambers. Partey. And it's got through. Chambers. There will be a throw in. And it's Chambers. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Real chance! I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Gets it upfield. And the first 45 minutes are up. What well, it has been an even contest, as the scoreline suggests, and it has been more than decent to watch. So in they come for the break with nothing to separate them. The score, 1-1. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Nketia. Has a hit! Only Potts tries his luck. It didn't come off, but an audacious effort. Oh, that's fantastic improvisation he showed there. Adjusted himself very quickly, but it's rare that they come off. Kapu. Raul Albiol. Kapu. Well, that's where he wants it. Uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Chambers. Plays it out to the wing. Granite Shaka. Cross deflected behind for a corner. They've played it short. And here's Shaka. He's in! Shapes to shoot! Rejo attempts a clearance. Battles to win it back. Partey. Alcacer goes looking. Caballos, Saka, Triqueros. Capu, Raul Albiol, Unquetia.
Granit Xhaka just brushed off the ball there. And it's Chambers. Tries to get it clear. Arsenal showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Foyt. Perejo plays it forward. And the finish! And no, he couldn't find the finish. You get the feeling that whoever scores the next goal here will be the winners of this tight. They can't afford to waste chances like that, though. Nketiah. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. I'll be, uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Caballos. It is now or never. Time is against them. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. And there goes the final whistle. So it's ended in a draw. Craft and graft and everything apart from a winning goal that never came. An intriguing contest and a result which at least partly satisfies all. Well, after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, neither side could get over the line here. Perhaps one team might...